second on here. Hi. <laughs> it was such a trick and I made it to Hungry Patches. And they say their spaghetti has enough sodium for 12 people. What? But you got one for you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Is this enough food? We don't know. I don't know. You got your own bucket and I got my own bucket. It has 10 piece, all spicy. Yeah, bucket just for you. And they have one of that. There's your gravies. Oh wow, they gave me two gravies too. Two gravies for family bucket. I ordered an ex two extras. Oh wow. Because you never know, you can't have gravy. It's a gravy. And um, let's see here. Oh yeah. So I got you a mashed potatoes. I got you an adobo rice. Ooh, adobo rice. I got the adobo rice and the mashed potatoes. Lots of gravies. Take that. I'm excited. I got my own spaghetti. Nice spaghetti. Mm -hmm. We're trying to count our calories. So I just paid for the soda, but we put water in there, so we're healthy. Water, spaghetti, yeah, healthy. Yeah, so water makes you healthy. Exactly, so we're gonna fill these up with waters. <laughs> Most expensive water ever. Mm, it's kind of buttery. Mm. Mm. Oh. Mm -hmm. mm. We want your farmer to play actually. Mm. Mm. Okay. Right? They had ranch before, but they were not out. They have a lot of things. Mm -hmm. Food shortage land. I'm happy they had spicy chicken. Mm -hmm. This is the last time they even have that. Okay. I think we're almost good. Mm -hmm. napkins here. If you ever need them, just let me know. Like, oh, All right, you guys. It's time to feast. I'm ready. What are we going to dig into first? Chicken. 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 Well, you were eyeballing like, a piece. I was eyeballing a thigh. I know. I'm, I'm a thigh person. Mm. It's so spicy. And you know they're spicy because they got these little like we're spicy. So I'm gonna do it without the gravy first so I can get that crunch. Mm -hmm. Cheers, Candy. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That skin's so crispy. Ooh, this is better than the last time I had it. Filipino people, a doctor and her. <laughs> Never two hours. Mm -hmm. mm. Flies to Philippines. Mm. It's gonna be a every day. But as you know, I love Filipino food. I just had it recently. But they didn't have no chicken, they just had a lot of <laughs> Oh yeah, she likes it. Ooh, you feel spicy. Mm -hmm. oh. Mm. Mm. oh, I'm so happy, Candy. Mmm. Gravy who? It doesn't even need gravy. It's not good. <laughs> it's so good. Gravy who is right. Mmm. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. Oh, and the thighs are. Oh man. What I love about chocolate beans, they only serve dark meat. They don't give you breasts. Mm -hmm. They only do the dark meat. Mm. It is our fault. I love the little hot dogs. You have little hot dogs in yours? Mm -hmm. Oh man. Ooh. Mm. These, this That's is good. good. I think I need napkin. <laughs> Y'all haven't tried the Filipino spaghetti? I'll show it. It's sweet. It's different than typical spaghetti. <clears throat> Sugar for some This is nice. Mm. <sighs> oh my god. You know what I really want to try next? Adobe rice. Mm. Do you like adobe rice? Do you remember? It's garlic. It's garlic. I have a bowl of trash. It's a spoon for you. Mm. I actually love their adobe rice. Mm. Like, really good. Mm. I like the smell. He doesn't even want to know everything that's in there. Just that's because it might be something I'd be like, no, I otherwise wouldn't have tried. To me, it just mm. it tastes garlicky. 
and savory. Mm -hmm. Some type of beef, I would think. Do you think that's beef, the brown meat chunks? Um, or is that like another part of the chicken that they re repurposed? It's, it could be chicken. Roller sandwich. <laughs> Yeah, I love how we blame it on the table. It's the table. It's the table. Oh, we've got too much food. <laughs> I love the Aloha burger. That's my favorite, but they don't have it. It has pineapple. But this is their regular yum burger, uh, their big yum burger. And I don't think I've ever had it. Oh, that's pretty. Look at that. Is yours like that? Blame it on the table. It's the table. It's the table. Oh, we've got too much food. <laughs> I love the Aloha burger. That's my favorite, but they don't have it. It has pineapple. But this is their regular yum burger, uh, their big yum burger. And I don't think I've ever had it. Oh, that's pretty. Look at that. Is yours something like that? That should be your t-shirt. I suffer for food. <laughs> oh my gosh, we had the Burger King breakfast. <coughs> I was hurting all that evening. The breakfast sausage. It was so good. But you were hurting? Hurt so bad. You know what's funny? Because one, once I got home, <laughs> right across the street from Jack in the Box. <gasps> you with your Jack in the Box. Yes. <laughs> yes. Because I can't have one meal a day. I'm going to go to sleep. Yes, yeah. You drench it. <laughs> or even Subway sometimes. They're like, oh, it's healthy. It's like, yeah, but I add olive oil. I add extra mayo. Cheese, extra provolone cheese. with shredded mozzarella. Mm -hmm. Extra, I mean, deli meat's not really supposed to be good for you. Sliced mm -hmm. deli, it's processed meat. Mm -hmm. And then I'll have them add mm -hmm. olive oil and then like chipotle ranch. And then like mm -hmm. extra olives. It's just, well, mm -hmm. it's olive extra oil. olives always. And so it turns into this like buttery, greasy, wet sandwich. <laughs> Sloppy good. Full of calories. Fries are last, because you know fries are fries. Yeah, fries. Uh, <sighs> uh, 
well, this is what, I guess the first or second time that you guys are seeing Candy on my channel. Mm -hmm. It's been eight months yes. since we've last been together. We've already filmed a few times for our channel. Mm -hmm. And months for mine, so I don't know if this will come out first. Mm. Uh, our first one will probably come out before our... <coughs> the what? I said your uh, first collab with me will probably come out before this one. Oh. Well, bef yeah. <laughs> yes. Unless I switch, but sometimes I switch. Yeah, oh, really? Mm -hmm. I try to keep mine in, in like chronological order. Just whenever. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Typically ends up to be the last minute, like like Friday night <laughs> oh. or or Tuesday night, <laughs> like last minute. I'm up in the middle of the night. It's like, let me hurry and get this done. So you won't film at like noon? Mm -hmm. and, oh, because you like to post in the morning. Yeah. My so schedule. you're like, you do a day before to do the filming part. Mm -hmm. I see. Yeah. I schedule it and everything. And then I'll still make mistakes and whatever. It's like, I, I, I have to film it, put it up, and then watch it. <laughs> mm. That's the hardest part watching them. Mm -hmm. I don't have to watch myself to be honest. Really? Oh, I watch it by myself. Really? I'm just like, I'm like, shut up. Yeah, that this time you're so bad is, is, all, is about me. Okay. <laughs> you like to watch yourself eat that food? Oh, uh, yeah, I like to watch myself. I don't know why. So I'm very self critical. It's like, it's like, oh, my hair's not quite right, or my makeup was screwy, or. Shit, it's self critical. So by the time this video comes out, you will have seen, well, hopefully not. <laughs> on her channel, she made me some homemade Alfredo sauce and uh, pasta. Mm -hmm. It was so good. And then again, she's like, it could have been a little better. I'm like, yeah. what? <laughs> oh, that was great. Well, I hadn't made fettuccine Alfredo sauce in over 10 years. So there, there were like little things that, once I make something, I, you know, I like figure out what I could do to make it better mm -hmm. the next time. So because I hadn't cooked it in so long, it was kind, it was kind of a, um, what do you call it? Um... An experiment. Mm. I was experimenting on you. I'm the experiment here. Experiment. Well, we both love Alfredo. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. We will be eating it again. Maybe not mine, but... Oh, the Cowboys. Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> I'm like, about food. Well, I've got tons of food in front right? of me. Right? I do that, that all the time. Yeah. I'll be eating and That's be like, true. I really want this. That's a true fatty. When you've got like a smorgasbord of food already in front of you, but you're you're about your next meal already. Yes. <laughs> I have done that. So people call me out for that. Like, focus on what's in front of you. Mm -hmm. You're gonna, you know, devour the whole earth here if you don't stop. <laughs> oh, mercy. I can't help myself out of that. It's in front of me. Oh, I know, it's here. I'm just like, well, it's okay, baby. Made. The nice thing about Jollibee, at least in my experiences, I've never been to a Jollibee where they're rude, mm -hmm. where they treat you like you're bothering them. Um, yeah, friendly customer service. They rarely forget things. Mm -hmm. I watch them, they're double checking, triple checking before they call your name. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a nice little uh, work ethic they got going. Mm -hmm. But you can't say the same about a lot of fast food places that we eat at. Right, right. You'll order 50 uh, chicken nugget challenge and they'll give you no sauce. <laughs> I know, what is it with them lately? <laughs> That's Candy's uh, experience. Recently, yeah, with, with both McDonald's and Jack in the Box. You know, uh, order, order. Luckily, those are greasy. And they're greasy and soft. Mm -hmm. But if that was, uh, let's see, who, who's a nugget's gonna ride hard sometimes? Sometimes greens, like really thick batter that gets all crustified. So if that was any other place, they'd be like hard little rocks with nothing yeah. to do. <laughs> and I've never had the 
with the Jack and Box nuggets before, so that was an experience, you know. <clears throat> but next time, I'd probably like them with a little bit of salt and salt. Well, last, uh, <laughs> last night, you know how I just said, uh, as soon as I got home, I walked into uh, Jack and Box, which was right across the street. And That's dangerous. Yes, literally, I walked there. Mm. And I just found out, because I could take my time, you know, that they have, I always order like ranch, I want to, they have to hear you. Yeah, I recently saw that, but I ordered the teriyaki for my nuggets. And they ordered okay. sweet and sour teriyaki and cotton on it. And they also have a... Um, I wanted to try it. Well, uh, I get extra sauce, I'll bring you some, because it's so... It's the best teriyaki I've ever had. Really? And when you dip those in nuggets and get teriyaki, oh, uh, I almost texted you. Like, <laughs> gotta try this one, too. That is so contagious. <laughs> and they have, like, an avocado... What? The green? Yeah, the little bit of avocado. How do you have that? I've tried that one. That was, that was really good. Screenings. Mm -hmm. How did all those people go? Yes. Like, yeah, this sell is, it. This is avocado. No, sauce. that was horrible. Was it also Tostitos? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, we, we tried the same thing. I was like, Ooh. after my video or before? Before. And I, I was telling, I was telling Susan that it was he had you were having a similar experience to what we did. We was like, we had like two or three jars of it. <laughs> nope, nope. Yeah, these, are, these are for the garbage man. <laughs> ordered three jars. Well, yeah, we jars. got three from the grocery store. I forget, forget why. We we're just stocking up on stuff, and it sounded really good. Uh, well, it was a little spicy for us, but it wasn't the spice that bothered me. It was just this weird taste. Weird flavor. It does not taste like avocado. Oh, it's like a, like a, like a stringent or sour. Yeah. Or it's like a spicy. Um, <sighs> I don't remember churches feeling it here. I'm thankful. And mm -hmm. I, I was nervous that it wouldn't be cold, but it was all still very hot. I mean, my yeah. mouth still feels hot. Mm -hmm. Like, it's everything was warm. Everything was, this was so good. Oh, now we get to nap. Yay. <laughs> now we can turn on those on the, on the chair. Yeah, the chair, the chair massagers are, it was worth it. It was mm -hmm. worth it. Okay. okay, you guys. Well, this was really fun to experience Jolly Bee with candy. Thank you for having me. You're my favorite person to eat with in general. You're one of my favorite people ever. Oh. I should just move next door uh, here. We should. We should definitely. We need a duplex. Oh my gosh. And then we, we would just keep like oh God, we encouraging would, each other to. We would. <laughs> thousand pound sister. Watch out. <laughs> oh my gosh. I mean, if I'll send you one little text, it's like, man, you gotta try these nuggets. And then I get a text of a photo. Got him. <laughs> I'm like, uh, just imagine if I lived here. We're enablers. Oh no. He didn't want to be a month longer, yeah. but he eats the leftovers. Well, then he wants to try it too, and then he gains weight. He's like, "Well, eff it! Yeah. Look at me now!" And he's, it's the eff it. Eff it. <laughs> I'm fat. I'm married to someone who's fat. I might as well just enjoy myself. Let's and then just we get, get fat and happy, and you know. And it just gets bigger and bigger. You know, and when, when it's time to go on a health journey, basically, you, everybody in the house has to do it, or it's just set up for failure. You have to. You have to do it together. And depending on what the journey <laughs> is, some people do plant based, some people do ketogenic, some people do vegan, some people do. Yeah. Whatever it is, you have to make sure that you don't have things that are not allowed on that path in the house. So, you know, for example, ketogenic, they'll have a lot of butter and stuff. So if you're vegan, you can't have butter, but if you smell it, someone's cooking with it, mm -hmm. make it real hard. <laughs> I, I was into raw food, and I, I didn't do this, but I knew so many people who would throw out their stoves. Really? To get rid of the temptation of how to cook. Wow. They would, they would take That's their, serious. They would take the stove out and put it in the trash or whatever. Well, not the, like the stove top, but with the oven, you could dehydrate. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs>
<laughs> yeah, my granddaddy uh, used to make homemade beef jerky. Oh. Because you know how dang expensive beef jerky is. Oh, yeah. Homemade's better. <laughs> mm -hmm. I remember making dehydrated tomatoes. It's little tomato chips. Mm. Mm, it was just like salt and bombs. Dehydrated fruit's like one of my favorite things. I love the dehydrated pineapple. Oh, yeah, God. little pineapple. <laughs> 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 Oh, that's what they look like, yeah. <laughs> they literally look like cookies. Daddy, get those cookies. Mmm. It's a little. I do it too. But, yeah, the, the pot, the dehydrated pot, I was like, my favorite. I really love it. And then there's the dehydrated mangoes. Wow. Well, anyways, so, Peter says about food. food. Well, we won't be throwing out our stoves anytime soon, though. No. Because we're still hungry. Yeah, I will still use the stove every once in a while. Well, this was really fun. I love how we get the giggles after we're like that food. We're just like... <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Party in the USA. Man. This was so good. Thanks for having me. Yes, thank you for being on my channel. <laughs> and being willing to collab with someone as crazy as I am. Mm-hmm. A lot of people don't, they wouldn't want to be, you're not around me. <laughs> so I really appreciate that, and I hope you guys love Watch Us Eat. Again, make sure you go to her channel. Link will be in the description box. And if you don't know, it's just Hungry Fat Chick. Hungry Fat Chick. And just go watch all her videos. I know when I'm dieting, she's the first place I go to watch <laughs> Eat. And I watch you all the time. Yeah, either when I'm trying not to eat or when I'm sitting down to eat. I